To activate or redeem a Steam code, it's actually very simple. But the first thing we need to do is to open up our Steam client and you want to make sure you're signed into your account. Once you're signed in, you want to click on the Games tab just on the top left hand side menu and you're going to get a few options. So the first option is to activate a product on Steam, such as a Steam game or some kind of Steam software. The second option is to redeem a Steam wallet code in case you want to put money onto your Steam wallet. In this example, we're going to be activating a Steam game, so we want to click on activate a product on Steam. From here, the product activation pop-up box will appear and it's going to give you some more information. You then want to click on the next button and it's going to give you the terms of service in case you want to read through that. And then you want to click on I agree. From here, we just need to copy and paste our product code into this box. So for this example, I've just purchased a copy of City Skylines from G2A. Usually this is about £35 on Steam, but I've managed to pick it up for about £7 on G2A, which is great. And if you are interested in picking up cheaper games, I'll leave a link to G2A in the description below. So what we're going to do now is click on show me the key. And here it's just generated the City Skylines product key. So we're going to copy this. And then I'm going to paste it into the product code box that I showed earlier. And it should look something like this. So once you're ready, you want to click on next. And after a few seconds, it's going to activate the Steam CD key. As you can see, it's recognized the correct game, which is City Skylines. And if you want to, you can always print a receipt. In this case, we're not going to do that. And we're going to click on finish. And that is all we need to do to redeem a Steam CD key. So if this video was helpful, please leave a like and pass it on to someone who may find it helpful. If you have any questions or comments, you can leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as I can.